Hello Year One children, hello to everybody at home who's working hard and everybody in school who's working hard. Our RE lesson today is all about friends and it's such a tough time isn't it at the moment because some people we're just missing our friends aren't we? I'm missing seeing my friends and I bet you'll see missing seeing your friends. Let's hope that it won't be too long before we can all get together and see each other and play with each other and have fun with each other and talk with each other all over again. This half term, we're going to be talking about Jesus being very special. Christians all around the world make friends with Jesus and believe that Jesus is a very, very special friend to have. So we're going to be learning a little bit more about that in the next few weeks. So take a look at these characters. Can you see they're all friends from cartoons and TV programmes? Who can you spot? Can you spot Woody and Buzz? Can you spot Anton Deck from the television? Who else do you know is who is a good friend? Just think for a little moment. How do you make friends? Who are your special friends? Hmm, what makes a person a good friend? How do you show that you're a good friend to somebody? And what activities do you like to do with your friends? Now, here's a story for you to sit back and enjoy. You just need to click the YouTube link and think about what makes Superworm a good friend. Sit back and enjoy it and pause the video. Did you enjoy that Superworm story? I love the stories by Julia Donaldson. She really is a good author, isn't she? Well, it's time for your independent task now. And it doesn't matter whether you print the sheet off or whether you draw your pictures on some paper, it does not matter at all. Take a look at the sheet that I've got here for you. Right in the middle, there is space for you to draw yourself. You can draw your whole body or you can just draw a really nice smiley face. Then there's space for four more friends in each one of the shapes on the sheet. And then at the bottom, I want you to do some thinking and think about what makes a good friend. Is it somebody who plays with you? Maybe it's somebody who shares. Maybe it's somebody who makes you laugh especially when you're not feeling very positive. I know I've got a friend who's like that. So have a think and finish off what makes somebody a good friend. Now it's time to be an RE detective and it's time to learn a little bit more about Jesus because over the next few weeks, we're going to be finding out about Jesus's special friends. I wonder if you can think about this. What are his special friends called? I've got a bit of a clue for you. His friends are his duh. I wonder if you can work it out. Have you heard that word before? What about his friends' names? I can tell you that there are two churches very close to our school and they're named after Jesus's friends. I wonder what they are. Saint J -j 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 and Saint B -b 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 -b. Well, I've got a clip of a song that I really like to listen to in RE and I like to sing along to. You can find the clip there and play it for yourselves. Maybe Next week, you'll remember some of the names of Jesus' special friends. There were 12 of them that he really was close to. Well, that's all for now. I can't wait to see the pictures that you draw of yourself and your friends. And I can't wait 
to hear about what you've been getting up to at home and at school when I've been busy not being able to see you. So I'm looking forward to seeing your lovely work. Take care. Bye everyone.